on the subscribe button and press on the bell icon to watch my all new videos yeah this is ujjwal kumar sen and you are watching ujjwal kumar sen youtube channel so in this tutorial you are going to learn about piezo meter or piezo meter so let's get started with definition i'm basic concept or what is it basically what is a piezo meter okay if you're talking about definition or what is all about this device d f y n i t r so definition actually uh, it is a kind of what manometer here i'm going to share with you one of the simple thing that is also important for computer examination that is what kind of manometer is this basically this is a simple manometer okay consisting of a simple pipe right i will share with you how it is working how we can measure pressure using this kind this type of manometer but here is the question yeah here is the question what's that what kind of pressure we can measure by using this manometer this is really important listen to me very carefully if possible write down somewhere so it is a kind of piezometer and it is simple type of piezometer we got this point but here is the question mark i have put it and i wanted to uh, share with you that what kind of piezometer is this that is by using this piezometer we can measure small and positive pressure this is suitable for measuring small and positive pressure remember this point this is really important this is okay this is really important right small and positive positive pressure measurement now uh, let's go back to the diagram by using the diagram we can easily figure out how we can able to uh, what how we can able to find out uh, pressure by using this uh, piezometer all right suppose that we are having a pipe okay and here we are fitting one small pipe in this pipe what it is flowing and we wanted to find out pressure at this point so whenever water is flowing if it is uh, open then what will happen water will go this side and this is because of capillarity you can say that right so because of this i mean because of this pipe how we can able to find out pressure at this point suppose that this is uh, point z at this point how we can able to find out so to understand this thing we have to draw another diagram and from that diagram we can able to understand the whole concept so here is it suppose that i mean we are just considering this is a this is what kind of uh, um, what kind of pipe we have circular pipe and we want to find out pressure at this point that is z so just uh, draw a reference line to be better for us later on how you will come to know and we have to just put this pipe so suppose that water is i mean water is going to a certain height suppose that this is h okay and we are here we have some i mean uh, for till till this point the water is going that side okay I mean, what is uh, what is uh, rising right now now here is the thing i mean this is really important i mean just uh, we have done all those things about piezo meter we have to just uh, focus on this point if we wanted to find out pressure at this point we need to understand one of the topic which i have already shared with you that is all about pressure pressure <coughs> exerted by liquid in a vessel so that concept we have to use here so uh, because of this you know because of rise of liquid given the pressure had at that point so is uh, the, uh, in this point and the liquid is rising because of that we have to find out pressure and for that we are having a formula what is about that formula i am just writing down i mean for finding out pressure at this point we are having a formula i mean to say that thing only so what is that p is equal to rho g h here what is rho density of the liquid which liquid we are having inside the pipe and h is i mean g is acceleration to gravity and h is height the rise of the liquid in this pipe so this is all about piezometer i hope you understand and uh, the most important thing i have shared with you the formula p is equal to rho g h for i mean this is useful for numerical problems but most of the time in the competitive examination they ask question from youtube
manometer which i am going to share with you in the next tutorial all right thanks for watching thank you very much and hope to see you soon in my next video tutorial if you haven't subscribed to my channel till now subscribe now and like this video and share with your friends that's why they will also come to know about piezometer its formula and important topic i mean important concept about it all right thanks for watching thank you very much bye bye